In terms of actually establishing what SACIT 2 means in terms of jurisdiction, in my view, we know that the significant nexus test is out, and that was out nine to nothing. Um, along, so out along with waters that were jurisdictional only under that test, such as ephemeral streams, at least as far as those streams are defined as ephemeral by this administration. And we know that the definition of adjacent when it comes to wetlands has been modified to exclude wetlands that are separated from a covered water by an upland feature, such as a bank or road or berm. At least I think we know that, although as I'll discuss in a minute, there could even be some complexity there um, that we could see developed in guidance in the future. 